Goodnight Mommy's story revolves around two twins, Elias and Lucas, who after the return of their mother from a hospital, begin to question whether or not the woman who returned is in fact their mother. With the exception of the beginning moments of the movie, Goodnight Mommy tells us or implies that the woman isn't the kid's mom. And this of course changes as more and more information is introduced. As the film progresses, we slowly go from being scared of the mother to being disturbed by the kid's actions. What starts off as an innocent war of attrition devolves into several violent acts from the children. The ending makes it clear from how it's presented that the woman is in fact the kid's mom and that Elias has merely gone mad from guilt. Guilt, which stemmed from the death of his brother Lucas, who more than likely died in a drowning accident. Every time we see Lucas, he is being imagined by Elias. And if you pay attention closely, every action that has any meaningful impact is done by Elias at the provocation of Lucas. In addition to that, most people in the film only look at or address Elias, which only further illustrates that Elias is in fact imagining Lucas. The surgery the mother had wasn't total reconstruction surgery, but a facelift which she got to get back into her old job of TV presenting, which is hinted at through dialogue and the pre-surgery photos. In the film, Elias finds out that the house is up for sale and that his mother made a video talking about herself. This seems like definitive proof to Elias that the woman isn't his mom, but that just isn't the case. The reason his mom is trying to sell the house is to get away from the place where her son died and to properly start over. The video of her talking about herself is more than likely for a dating site, which she is on because her husband and her split up after the death of Lucas. In the end, Goodnight Mommy is a tale of survivor's guilt and grief. Do you agree with my explanation of Goodnight Mommy's ending? Comment down below if you do or don't.